Hello everyone, Fed here, and welcome back to another Minecraft PE Redstone tutorial. In this video, I'll be showing you how to build a very simple auto armor equipper, and you can also throw the armor back at it so you don't have to keep holding on to it. So let's go ahead and come right here. All I have to do is flip up this lever, and I will be auto armor equipped. So here we go, bloop. And as you can see, my character will be fully auto armor equipped. And then, of course, once I am done going out and I want to put my armor away, just come back over here, flip the lever back down, take off my armor. So let's go to my armor tab. Sorry, I'm still not very good at all the Minecraft PE stuff yet. So I'm going to go ahead and take off all my armor, come over here, and then just throw my armor right back at this block. And it will put it right back inside my armor equipper. So if I wanted to go ahead and do it again, so bloop, as you can see, I will be auto armor equipped again so let's go ahead and look at the redstone guys this thing is super easy i built this thing in the past i just had to change up a few little things to make it work on minecraft pe very very easy auto armor equipper and it's also fantastic because we get to put the armor back so let's go ahead and start building this thing guys all right guys so for this build you're going to need a three by four spacing and you're also going to have to dig down too now that redstone clay block is the exact spot where your auto armor equipper is going to be going now the resources you're going to need for this build are one hopper one piston one dispenser one redstone comparator, two redstone repeaters, one lever, one minecart with a rail, one rail, and three redstone. All right, guys, so once you have your three by four spacing, dug down your two and gathered up all your resources, come to the bottom left hand corner. I'm going to count over one block and place a dispenser right on top of it. Then going into the side of the dispenser over here, we're going to go into sneak mode and or crouch mode, whatever you would like to call it. As you can see, I am crouching. And we're going to place our hopper off the side of the dispenser. Next up, coming out. Of our dispenser right here we're going to place a comparator going towards that way so place your comparator down and then set your comparator to subtraction mode next up place a block in front of your redstone comparator a piece of redstone right in front of that a block to the right hand side of your redstone and then coming out of this block we're going to place another repeater going that way set it to one tick and place a piece of redstone going into the side of the comparator Next up, swing to the right-hand side. Place another piece of redstone here. We should be completely done with our redstone. Place down yet again another repeater with a block right in front of it like that. Next up, take out your rail and your minecart with a hopper. And right above this hopper, go into sneak mode and place a block right above it. Place your rail on top of it. Place your minecart with a hopper on top of that. And then go ahead and break the block and let it fall into place. And as you can see, it already pushed the rail in. So let's go ahead and pick up that rail. Now, last but not least, we're going to have to take out a slab of your color of choice. I'm going to go ahead and just use a stone slab. So place your slab right above your dispenser by going into sneak slash crouch mode once again. And now we're going to take out our blocks of choice because we want to hide up this micro with hopper. We don't want to be able to see it. So go ahead and take out your blocks of choice. I'm going to be using a dark oak. There we go. Dark oak with planks. So go ahead and take out your block of choice and just place it all the way around your slab like this. There we go. And then place it right next to your minecart with a hopper as well and place it right around the lip of it. Now what we're going to have to do is push one of these into the minecart with a hopper. So what I like to do is come out two more blocks right here. One, two, break the block, place a piston facing inwards like this, and then send power to it with your lever. So bloop. And as you can see, now the minecart with a hopper is inside that block. Go ahead and pick up your piston. It's no longer needed. Next up, just go ahead and hide that minecart with a hopper right over here with your block of choice. Take your lever, we're going to need the lever, and place it right here off the side. And that's it, guys. You are completely done. So when it's flipped towards you, that means it's off. And then when it's flipped on, that means you will get auto armor equipped like right here. So let's go ahead and turn it off. You have to make sure it's off when you throw your armor in. So I quickly went ahead and just took off all my armor. So let's go ahead and throw it in there. So make sure your lever is facing towards the slab. That means it is off. So let's go ahead and throw all our armor in there. So now all our armor is inside of there. And then when we're ready to leave and get auto armor equipped, just come right here on the slab. Click it up. We will be auto armor equipped and ready to go fight the day. And then, of course, when we come home, flip it down. Go ahead and just come back into your inventory and then take off your armor. So let's go over here. Take off all of our armor. Over. There we go. Come down. There we go. Take off all your armor. I'm sorry. I'm still not used to the whole layout. Bloop. Let's go ahead and throw our armor right back into there. So boop, boop, boop. And, of course, boop. And there we have it, guys. Our armor is ready to be put on once again. But there you guys go. That is how you build a very simple auto armor equipper. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave it a like and subscribe. Stay tuned with my newest videos. All right, guys. Boop. And peace.